virtualized data centers brought you Infrastructure as a Service, IaaS, and Platform as a Service, PaaS offerings. IaaS offerings provide raw compute, storage, and network, organized in ways that are familiar from data centers. PaaS offerings, on the other hand, bind application code you write to libraries that give access to the infrastructure your application needs. That way, you can just focus on your application logic. In the IaaS model, you pay for what you allocate. In the PaaS model, you pay for what you use. Both sure beat the old way, where you bought everything in advance based on lots of risky forecasting. As cloud computing has evolved, the momentum has shifted towards managed infrastructure and managed services. GCP offers many services in which you need not worry about any resource provisioning at all. We'll discuss many in this course. They're easy to build into your applications and you pay per use. By the way, now that I've mentioned PaaS and IaaS, you might be asking yourself, what about SaaS? Of course, Google's popular applications like Search, Gmail, Docs, and Drive are software as a service applications in that they're consumed directly over the internet by end users. G Suite is outside the scope of this course, although I hope you like it.